Hi there, Cosmic Family. My name is Yesley Allen, this incarnation. Today, I wanted to do a reflection about relationships and miracles. And um, I decided to do this video in the other channel because um, there were there were a lot of people that um, were resistant to the concept of twin flames. And it's important to say that I'm only using that um, label just to describe uh a profound connection, but uh, I'm putting a label because uh, is the way I'm finding to, to give a structure to something. Uh, but uh, you can put the label you want. And I am, I'm going to share um, uh, a few things about my, my, own, my own story. Because um, I already told you that when I when I started this uh, task about recording videos and uploading them to YouTube, the main reason is because was and is <laughs> um, because we are at the end of the times. We are the generation that is going to confront the transition between ages, um, between eras, and uh, we are going to see how the um, a paradigm is ending and the the beginning of a new one. That's one reason. The other reason is because I was very honesty uh, about this. I I was very honest. Sorry about this. I am in contact with uh, things of another dimension. Many of us are, but many times uh, this connection is refining. Um, in the process of our own evolution. That's all. Um, I mean, I, I I want to repeat this because uh, I don't feel special about this or something. I'm a human being that make uh, mistakes and learn about them like everybody else. And this is not uh, something, you know, this is not, not something that is happening to me only. Uh, so, the third reason why I started this this YouTube channel, it is because um, I am in a process of twin flame, and I am in a twin flame process. Sorry. So uh, that's why I am very inspired um, by Jesus and Mary Magdalene. I I already talked about them. I'm gonna leave the link uh, in the first comment, like I always do, and. I am not um, put them. I, I'm not doing it idolatry with them. I'm only inspired by, by their mission and the things they did and and the the light they brought to this place. But uh, I put the the example of them because they were twin flames. And twin flames is just again a concept to describe a relationship or a connection with someone that is. Um, that is bringing you to an enormous process of evolution. And I think all the people do that for us, actually. But I didn't experiment something uh, that profound before I, I met my uh, dream flame, my soulmate, or whatever you want to call it. Being honest about uh, my own process of evolution since I uh, meet again this person because I already knew him in this one life. Uh, I'm not talking only about other lives. Um, when since I I, I meet him again, uh, my process has this acceleration and uh, have become uh, stronger, harder, faster. Um, it it was many things uh, that happened since that moment. So, uh, I mean, this connection really changed me. In a in a in a beautiful way, uh, but it become something that got me closer to myself, to my essence, and to uh, unconditional love. Not only for that person, but for everybody to practice that. In I mean, it's not an easy practice. So uh, I want to share a part of my story where. I didn't meet this person, but I had a, a friend of mine that was in that process with um, 
uh, the twin flame in a, that was in a twin flame process. And I couldn't comprehend at that time what um, this person was experimenting because uh, this is something that we cannot transmit by words. It's really an experimentation of the soul. But I did not um, discredit what this person was uh, experimenting only because I didn't, I wasn't leaving it. Uh, but I mean, th there was uh, this part of me that um, couldn't understand it in, in, in its all, you know. So what happened, I, what, the thing I want to share is that I, I was in a relationship at the time with a person that wasn't my twin flame, uh, that wasn't reflecting uh, that thing, and that was uh, a projection of lack. I already told you about the, these kind of relationships. I think everybody uh, goes uh, through this uh, at, at least once in their life or more. For me, uh, it was uh, more than one. <laughs> so um, this thing, uh, this process of this friend, um, all the things that I heard from the connection that my friend was experimenting uh, brought me this feeling of, I don't have this. <laughs> I am uh, with a person that it's not my dream flame and I, um, I'm not feeling good about this. But that didn't make me uh, to to say to that person, oh, all your process is uh, it's a lie, it's bullshit. <laughs> uh, because I am nobody to say that to anyone that is saying that it is living and feeling and, and you know, uh, going through something. So I took responsibility for that and... Um, well, I had this dream uh, one night um, with my twin flame, um, months before I, I met him. So um, I really, really, really wanted this special connection. Uh, I didn't know at the time that I had to uh, work a lot more in myself, but um, I, I quit that relationship uh, without uh, any certainty of the future. I quit everything, I quit my job. I did a lot of changes. I uh, left relationships, friends behind, and I did a lot of, uh, I did a lot of changes in order to manifest um, this new thing that I wanted, but with a faith that is um, operating, you know, uh, this is the, axis virgo pisces the magic has has to put uh, in order to manifest magic you have to put action and steps in in not always a, a planification exactly but uh, it takes uh, steps to get there you know uh, it's not some magic it's totally possible i I see, I saw magic operated, operating in many things. Um, I told you about my healing. I didn't tell you uh, an, an experience I, I, I went through in Peru in where I, I healed uh, another person that was very big. Maybe in other video, I will tell you about that if you want to. Uh, <laughs> There's no many subscribers uh, yet, but um, I could tell you about that. Okay, so um, this 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 thing uh, I did, believing that I could manifest that. Well, uh, I remembered uh, that uh, it, it was a new moon, and and I did a, a ritual, um, and I I wrote in a paper everything everything that i wanted from other person i i wasn't asking uh, things that i i i wasn't you know i was i was asking um things that i i wanted to share i the things that i wanted to to know uh, like sacred sexuality for example 
uh, and the, the, all the description in that video is something that I learned, that I remembered. Uh, nobody told me uh, how to do that. Uh, I remembered uh, all this, the, the steps uh, with my twin flame. So uh, that's how. Uh, that's why I, I, I shared that with you. Um, so I wrote everything, everything that I I, I wanted in a in a person, and uh, I didn't gi give um, I didn't give any description, any physical description, because I didn't care. Uh, I just put uh, you know uh, a, a, a man that I like, <laughs> and and that's all. But I I really wanted uh, to share um, that profound things. So months. Uh, a couple of months um, then uh, I, I found him uh, I found him in a train so that's when the, the story began uh, it, this was um, a couple of years ago so magic really really happens in life uh, miracles really happen, but you have to. Miracles are a product of things we do when uh, we are in a moment that is difficult. It's uh, it's a product of an aligning with our uh, the higher dimensions of our soul in a moment that is very difficult to do that. And because we are doing something extraordinary, uh, that's why that's that's how uh, we are manifesting then miracles because we are doing something miraculous uh, um, in a moment that is difficult to do it. So I, I you know, kept believe, believing in love um, in spite of all the bad things that I uh, lived once. And I stopped to, to create this thing about, uh, you know, uh, a profound connection is a fantasy because I, I think that people that Think these kind of connections are fantasies because they are, they are uh, far from their own love. Because why, <laughs> why is it not possible? You know, and uh, I think everything is possible, everything. But our uh, our limited thoughts prevent prevents us uh, from from manifesting those things. So miracles are totally totally a, a, a thing, totally a, a truth, if we want to. Magic, it is too. But many times we, uh, you know, the rational mind controls us and prevents us from, from manifesting magic in our lives. So I am telling this, I am telling this story only because I wanted to share all the things I did in order to manifest this connection. And it doesn't care if I am not with that person right now. Uh, it doesn't care because all the I, I am not re regretting uh, a single minute of all this process. And um, although it has been tough, uh, like life is it, tough many times, but uh, life has uh, all these good moments too but we are like uh, wired many times to only focus on the bad things and I think that's uh, that takes effort to change but we have to practice because if you if we really want uh, another kind of life if we are uh, not liking the one that we have um, we have to practice on, on the on the focus uh, of other things the things we really want because uh, this is a law everything we put the focus on uh, will uh, make it bigger and uh, will will we will have more of that in abundance and we don't want in abundance things we don't want <laughs> so brothers and sisters uh, I, I just wanted to, to share that part of my story because um, it was very important for me to take responsibility and not to project, uh, for example, in my friend's life, you know, uh, you're lying about this and you're obsessed with that person and uh, she was really um, experimenting that and then I could understand all the things she, she was saying at that time because I, I live it 
myself. So when you have a wish of your soul that is, um, when you have a wish that is very that brings evolution to your life, it's a wish of your soul. And if your if your soul is wishing that, it is because it's a it's a remember of the future. Uh, the soul uh, wants something because uh, it knows that uh, in other quantic line that is already manifested. So I am ending the video here. Thank you, everybody, and I'll see you tomorrow. Ciao, ciao.